The fate of the first parent on trial for their child's deadly school shooting will soon be in the hands of a jury. Jennifer Crumbly charged with those four unprecedented counts of involuntary manslaughter. The prosecution claiming she was too wrapped up in her own hobbies and extramarital affairs to pay attention to her son's cries for help. Crumbly took the stand yesterday in her own defense. I've asked myself if I would have done anything differently and I wouldn't have. I wish he would have killed us instead. In their closing argument, prosecutors telling the jury this case is about what Crumbly knew and did not do. She walked out of that school when just the smallest, smallest of things could have saved, could have helped Hannah and Tate and Madison and Justin. The first thing I want to do... Crumbly's defense attorney countering, claiming the prosecution cherry-picked evidence to turn the jury against her slamming piles of pages on the podium. You don't have to like her. It's important to set aside your opinions of her. The defense arguing this case is very dangerous for parents in this country, saying Crumbly was a hypervigilant mother, but her son was a skilled manipulator. I am asking that you find Jennifer Crumbly not guilty, not just for Jennifer Crumbly, but for every mother who's out there doing the best they can, who could easily be in her shoes. Our thanks to Trevor. Hi everyone, George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.